Hello, everyone. I love y'all. Peace be unto you. Hey, I got a little challenge for everybody. Uh, name one bad thing that can happen by obeying God's commandments. And if not one bad thing can be named by obeying God's commandments, then why are so many people, and the churches especially, trying to get rid of them and say they're no good anymore? Let's find out. Jesus wasn't against them, and we shouldn't be neither. We're going to go over here to Matthew 5, see what he had to say. Here we are, Matthew chapter 5, verse 17. Think not that I'm come to destroy the law or the prophets. I'm not come to destroy, but to fulfill. For verily I say unto you, till heaven and earth pass, one jot or tittle shall I know wise pass from the law, till all be fulfilled. Whosoever therefore shall break one of these least commandments, and which one would they say is least? Probably the Sabbath, seventh day, and shall teach men so to break them. He shall be called least in the kingdom of heaven. Uh, he's telling all these church people then that they're the least. That's like a pile of poop or something, ain't it? Sorry, I don't, I'm just being honest. He calls them least. But whosoever shall do and teach these commandments, teach them, the same shall be called great in the kingdom of heaven. Let's go over here now to Revelations. All right, we're going to go over here to Revelations chapter 12, one chapter over and get another little verse there. Here we are, Revelations 12, and we're going to verse 17. And the dragon was wrought with the woman, which is church, and went to make war with the remnant of her seed which keep the commandments of God and have the testimony of Jesus. So devil has got waging war against people who want to keep God's commandments. Alright, we're in Revelations 14, going down here to verse 12. John says, Here is the patience of the saints. Here are they that keep the commandments of God and the faith of Jesus. Start and see it. Go to Revelations 22 now. Revelations 22, verse 14. Blessed are they that do His commandments, that they may have right to the tree of life, and may enter in through the gates into the city. For without are dogs, sorcerers, and whoremongers, murderers, adulterers, whosoever loveth maketh a lie. Leave you comments down there and let me know if there is any one bad thing that can come out of Keeping God's commandments. They're based on love. That's all I see. Love you.